announced when I was going to run against Melissa Bean, I said, my name is Joe Walsh, I feel like I'm losing my country, and I'm angry at Republicans and Democrats for putting us on a path that's going to bankrupt our kids and our grandkids. That's the only reason I ran. And I don't care if I've made life miserable for Nancy Pelosi or John Boehner. If we don't change this quickly, I fear, fear the country he's going to grow up in. He's going to be an adult in. We have to stop that. So, go sit with your mom and dad, Parker. <laughs> two final points. Two final points. What am I going to do? Um, you guys know that I am the wealthiest member of Congress. <laughs> I'm going to probably take a few years off and just live on all of my investments. I think two years in a row, I think I'm still the poorest member of Congress. So come January, I've got to find a job. Am I going to run again? Here's what I know. We're losing our America. Uh, I have been called in whatever role to play a role trying to get this back. Whether that means I run again, who knows? Uh, it'd be kind of fun to run against Dick Durbin, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what else. I'll tell you what else. This state needs a Republican Party. The reason Michael Madigan can dominate this state is because there's no Republican Party. Right. This Republican Party needs a Scott Walker to run for governor. And I have, <laughs> I have not seen or heard that candidate yet. I will not step, sit by and let some establishment fuddy-duddy Republican be our candidate again when this state needs to be totally safe. So I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I, really, I really, truly don't. Um, but I'm going to stay involved in this fight. 